Well, according to Tom Quince's latest book, Gilded Youth, an intimate history of growing up in the royal family. Princess of Wales Kate Middleton had to have a fertility test before marrying the current heir to the British throne, Prince William. Furthermore, if she had been discovered to be infertile, the marriage may have been called off entirely. According to the book, Middleton's marriage to William was permitted due to a few measures. It is unusual for a future king like William to marry a commoner from a middle classes. According to Quinn, Princess Diana had to go through similar exams before marrying the current King Charles III. These are always carried out to ensure a future queen is able to have a child. If Kate had not been fertile, there is a little doubt the marriage would have been off, says Quinn, quoted by a news magazine. According to the author, Princess Diana was unaware that the tests she had were designed to assess her fertility. She assumed it was simply a routine medical exam. Diana complained in a brief encounter with the present author that she had in all innocence thought her premarital checkups had to do with general health, only realizing later on that she had actually been tested for fertility. I was so innocent. I went just along with everything at that stage, she said. See Squin in his book. On April 29, 2011, they married in a lavish and well-publicized wedding at Westminster Abbey in London. The wedding was a worldwide event with an estimated 2 billion people watching the live broadcast. Kate's gown, created by Sarah Burton of Alexander McQueen, was hailed for its beauty and timeless appeal. Several high-profile guests attended the wedding, including members of the royal family, leaders of state and celebrities. The pair exchanged woes and rings, and William gave Kate his mother, Princess Diana, a sapphire and diamond engagement ring. Following the ceremony, the newlyweds led a parade through London's estate before joining guests at the reception at Buckingham Palace. They later travelled to Seychelles for their honeymoon. Kate and William's marriage was viewed as a sign of modernization and progress within the royal family, as Kate was the first non-aristocratic bride to marry a potential monarch in almost 350 years. With three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, the couple has become noted for their public appearances, humanitarian activities and commitment to family life. Well, what do you think about the situation? Do let us know in the comment section below. But before that, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to One India News.